Welcome to the OSU Football Update. I'm Barry Trammell with OSU writer Gina Mizell. And Gina, just new on the job, just uh, arrived in town this week. Uh, from afar, tell us your impressions uh, of Oklahoma State football. Well, it's definitely a program that's on the rise and, and something that um, even from afar, even from Arizona, from California, where I've been the past month, months or so, it's definitely a program that you can tell you think of their offense and you think of Brandon Whedon and you think of Justin Blackman and just so much star power there and such a fun team to watch too. And obviously I, I had a little bit of, of a closer close up because I, I watched them in the Alamo Bowl against Arizona, which is ASU's rival. So that was kind of my first time really seeing them really, really close up and they were just so impressive in that game. And so I think uh, the expectations are high, rightfully, rightfully so. And this is a team that I think has a chance to potentially play for the national championship this year. Is a, you know you grew up you grew up in the Phoenix area and um, you know the Pac-12. Mm -hmm. uh, any any observations about the differences between Pac-12 ball, Big 12 football? Uh, how, how do you expect those to mesh? Sure. I mean, the Big 12 has obviously turned into such a pass-happy league as well. I mean, you think of the old school Big 8, Big 12, and, and you think of running the football, but now with all the spread offenses, and obviously in the Pac-12, it's, it's very, very big there too with, with Oregon and, and what they do and some other teams. And so um, it, I'm definitely used to seeing offense, and so that, that's not going to change uh, with covering this team. So, um, you know, I'm looking forward to, uh, to just uh, seeing this offense and seeing how this defense stacks up too, because that's obviously where the biggest questions are heading into the season. You know, your, your first uh, your first media availability in terms of getting to interact with coaches and players comes mm -hmm. later in the week. What are you looking most forward to in terms of getting getting to know some of these uh, players and coaches? Sure. I mean, I love just getting to know players and coaches' personalities, too. Obviously, I, I, I love getting a chance to, um, you know, know them on the football field and know how they practice and know how they play, but just kind of little side things that you get to know about people as well. And I'm obviously definitely looking forward to meeting with Coach Gundy. I've seen a lot of interviews with, with guys like Brandon Whedon and seems like, a, you know, a great person to talk to and can interact with. And so um, I'm looking forward to all of it and just getting a chance to know these people, letting them get a chance to know me and, you know, maybe learning a little bit about them outside of football as well. Well, excellent. Uh, look forward to the coverage. Stay tuned for further OSU football coverage every day in the Oklahoman and here on News OK.